How will it affect your bird if you would have left it alone for a vacation? Can your bird know if you're a good or a bad person? Does your bird know the meaning behind a kiss? And what is the key to winning your bird's heart and becoming its favorite human? In today's video, we'll answer these intriguing questions that will help you understand how your bird sees and senses the world. They say dogs and cats are capable of sensing whether you're a bad or a good person. But did you know that your bird can also do that? In this video, you'll find out how your feathered friend can use its senses to recognize a bad person, and whether it can protect you as well. Can birds sense a bad person? Birds don't have special powers that allow them to read people's minds but they definitely have their natural senses that can tell them what your intentions are. For example, you may have noticed it's difficult to catch your bird, and that's because it can read your body language. And know you actually plan to catch it long before you even raise your hand. Your bird can even feel it when you're sad. Many owners report that their birds become sad too whenever their owners are in a bad mood, some birds don't even want to leave their cages, and some want to snuggle and cheer up their owners. So yeah, birds can indeed sense a bad person. They are constantly on guard and pick up on clues that tell them whether you're safe or dangerous to be around. Birds are animals of the sky. They are known to be observers, and they observe their surroundings and the people around them all the time. When your bird sees a bad or dangerous person, it will be on its full defensive mode. Keep in mind that birds can also detect fear in humans. When we are fearful, from a bite for example, we change a bit. We breathe heavily, we tense up, and perhaps we tremble a little. It's on full display and our birds can sense that. Can birds be protective of their owners? Birds are often looked at as stupid and not very caring, even for their owners. But truth is, birds can be just as protective of their owners as dogs and cats. Birds that are known to have one favorite owner will be more aggressive toward other people and protective and jealous toward their owner. You can also see how protective birds can be when looking at their flock and mates. Birds have very high emotional intelligence and they will care, protect, and love you and their long life mate. Many bird owners feel sad and guilty while being away from their precious pet bird. But the question is, does your bird miss you when you leave the house? Will your bird remember if you've gone on a vacation for a while? And why do birds ignore us when we call them? In this video, we'll answer if birds miss and remember their owners. Does your bird recognize you? Your bird not only knows who you are, but it can even tell you apart from strangers and other people within your own home. Your bird even has a favorite person. It may prefer being around you over others. Birds naturally feel affection for those who play with them, feed them, or care for them, though they don't always make it obvious. Your bird knows the sound of your voice and the look of your face and recognizes you as its owner, even after long periods apart. Does your bird miss you? Birds definitely miss their owners while they are away. Research has shown that birds feel safer and more secure when their owners are around and may even experience stress and separation anxiety when their owners are gone. This can sometimes be a very stressful experience for a pet bird, especially if they're left completely alone and in silence. Of course that, just like humans, birds will have different personalities. This means that some birds won't care as much as others. Why does your bird ignore you? If your bird knows your voice and trusts you, why does it ignore you when you call its name? Well, your bird is responding but in its own unique way. 
Birds aren't as immediately affectionate as dogs. They won't come running and jumping to your face, but will simply act more alert and will tilt their head towards you to listen as if you have something important to say. For how long can a bird remember a person? Some bird species, like crows, have been found to remember faces for up to five years and sometimes even more. With pet birds, it differs. Some owners of small and big parrots report that their birds recognize them immediately, even after months apart, while others have seemed to forget. For us people, a small kiss or a hug is a form of love and affection. And that's why it's common to see bird owners kissing and cuddling with their birds. But does your bird actually understand kisses and hugs? Or does it think you're strange and just rolls with your odd behavior? Do birds really like hugs and kisses? When we see a person we love, or our cute bird, we immediately want to touch them, kiss them, and show them our love. But at the same time, it is important to remember that birds are very different species, with their own methods of communication. Within your bird's mind, kissing and hugging don't really exist. And now you're probably thinking that you see your birds kissing each other all the time. But that's just your perception. Most times, your birds are kissing during bonding, and what is actually happening is that the male bird is passing food to the female one. You can also see a form of a kiss when two birds are preening each other. But what they're actually doing is spreading their feathers, such as those on the head and face, that the other bird can't reach. If you kiss or hug your bird to show affection, it might not understand your purpose behind this behavior. Unfortunately, a gesture of affection of this kind might be felt like an invasion of your bird's personal space. Can your bird learn kisses? With given time, your bird may learn to associate kisses as a display of affection. Although birds do enjoy being quite independent, they still like receiving attention and spending time with the people they trust. Oftentimes, our bird may show us its love by being needy, tilting their heads for a scratch, or just wanting to spend time with us. How to tell if your bird doesn't want to be kissed? A bird who does not want to be kissed will show its stress by giving you certain signals. Some birds will bite or hiss, while others might just fly away and avoid you altogether. And this is the perfect moment to remind you to never force your bird into doing something it does not want to do. How to show your bird affection. There are many ways to show your bird affection beyond kisses. If your bird lets you, bonding with scratches and pets is an excellent way to show affection. Your bird will surely appreciate a gentle rub around its head. And for those who have birds that are more skittish and just don't like being touched, you can either give them time and try taming them, or just accept their personality and show your love through different ways, like feeding them treats and spoiling them with toys. If you've ever lived with birds in a household of multiple people, you may have noticed that your bird will often tend to prefer a particular person over another. Believe it or not, there are several behaviors and characteristics that make people appealing to your bird. And anyone who meets these certain requirements is likelier to receive your bird's affection. In this video, we will talk about how birds choose their favorite human and how you can become your parrot's favorite person. The breed does matter. Some parrot breeds are known to prefer and connect with only one person, like an African Grey for example. But other breeds will obviously always have their favorite human, but will also enjoy spending time with other people around them. Handling Handling is the key to earning your bird's bond and respect. Birds want to remain in control of their environment. This means that being cornered and grabbed without request can make a bird lose its trust in you. The best way of getting your bird's love is not forcing it to interact with you. Instead, encourage your pet to want the contact.
Don't pet, pick up, or corner your feathered friend against their will. It's best to let the bird make the first move. Your voice. By nature, birds are nervous and afraid of humans. And there are some behaviors that can make people less appealing to birds. For example, birds find loud noises or sudden movements to be stressful. Birds may even try to avoid people who behave in ways that are impulsive, frightening or distressing to them. If your bird views you as a source of safety, it will be more likely to be drawn to you. Come here, you baby bird, come on. Yeah. Owners with high-pitched voices also report that their birds love it and can mimic them very easily. Food. Your bird's survival instincts controls it for a large part of its day, and only a few things are more important than food. So it should come as no surprise that birds show affection to people who offer them food. This means the person providing treats and spoiling food to a bird will be highly valuable to it and is likely to win its favor. Age Becoming your bird's favorite person will also depend greatly on how old it is. If you took your bird while it was a chick, your bond will be much better as it will look at you as the human who raised it, almost like a parent. But if you got your bird while it was older, it will naturally be more difficult to tame and bond with, as it already had a previous life before you got it. That does not mean you can only tame a young bird, it's just that an older bird will require more time and work.